Hello YouTube, welcome to another review of another TV series by the guy sitting in the chair here, Eric. Today I will be reviewing Troy, Fall of a City. Yet another Netflix show, they keep pumping those out recently. Naturally I was really excited about this show coming out because I was a huge fan of the film Troy. Wolfgang Peterson's and Brad Pitt's take on the epic legend. It's one of my all time favorite legends to watch and hear about. However, sadly, I felt the series felt way short of my expectations. I felt the story lost any sense of credibility when Paris was introduced as this farm boy and the whole Garden of Eve apple scene in the beginning. I wasn't buying any of that. And how rushed along his upbringing felt, it was like, oh, okay, there's this scene of the Apple of Eve, and now he is all of a sudden going back to this beach, and he's going to fight these soldiers, and he's going to go in the city, and then he's going to become a prince, and he's going to go find Helen, and it's just so boom, ba boom, ba boom, ba boom. It's like, okay. I also didn't care for his introduction or his love for Helen in the show. I didn't buy any of it. I felt their romance is very Star Wars isk. Natalie Portman, you know, it really didn't feel any connection there at all, which is kind of an important part of the story because you need to believe that these two really truly love each other because they're you know causing an entire war to break out. He was like, okay, I'll go there. Oh, there she is. Okay, hey, come back with me. Oh no, I can't. Oh yes, you can. Okay, okay, I'm following back you. And that was pretty much how it went. It was like. Their romance was never believable and completely bland at best. I felt the show as a whole was held back by really bad writing and a bad script and subpar to terrible acting. There was barely any fighting in this at all. I know Troy, no fighting. A lot of it's just, oh no, an arrow whizzed past me or oh, I see you, let me clash my sword with yours. A lot of it too is just them standing around talking about fighting, like, oh, today's fighting was really bad, but we never saw any of that, so how are we supposed to know? I did not care about either side of the war. Either side could have won, and I would have just shoulder shrugged and been like, okay. I did not care or feel attached to any of the characters in the show. Any character could have died, and I would have been like, okay. The entire show was extremely slow paced. It was like, let's take the best parts from the two and a half hour movie and then add on five plus hours of filler to go with it to make a series. Often while watching this, I found myself falling asleep multiple times or checking my phone, you know, anything to get my attention away from what I was watching because I was not interested. The series is incredibly boring. The only decently entertaining scene of the entire series was Hector and Achilles' epic face-off. Even that was done poorly compared to the film that I saw, which I love. Now I do have to give a shout out to Johnny Harris as Agamemnon. I think he did a great job in this show as that character. Otherwise, every other character like his brother or Paris or even Hector or anybody else all felt like spoiled brats, honestly. Like, oh, I didn't get my way. Ah. The Great Achilles was just a pushover. Like, oh, you want to take my girl? Okay, uh, here you go. Yeah, I can't, I won't stop you. I'll be upset. I won't fight for today, but... <laughs> really, I'm done talking about this show. You can tell by my lack of enthusiasm, I really did not like it that much. There was an intriguing middle plot line. The start of the show and the end of the show sucked, but the middle was interesting. It had some potential there. The fight between Achilles and Hector was pretty entertaining. Agamemnon's performance was well done. But other than that, there's really nothing to see here. And I will have to give Troy, Fall of the City, a C-. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see future content that myself or Jaika or both of us put out, please feel free to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, a thumbs down if you didn't, and feel free to comment any other opinions you have. Maybe you love the show, maybe you want me to review a certain show, let me know. Thank you, and I will see you next time. You rock.